And one thing I did have to deal with on the way over here that I don't want to deal with on the way back is all of these mines. As you can imagine, I wasn't too keen on walking across that the first time round. Hello everybody and welcome, you are watching Dave Playing Games. My name is Dave and I am playing Fallout 4. Last time out we got massively distracted by a bunch of robots on a ship and they sent us on a bunch of other quests and we haven't really done what we planned to do with Jack Cabot but all that changes today. We are going to go pick up Curie and then carry on with the job that we set out to do, go to the Insane Asylum. Whilst we're in town however, I'm going to have a quick look and see if I can find one of those power relay coils in one of the shops. Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay, we'll just have to keep our eye out. So onto the memory den. Don't worry, Kiri, here I come. Okay, dude, I think you've got a problem. Here we go. I... I just don't have the caps to keep her alive anymore. Life support ain't easy or cheap, you know? I was gonna pull the plug on her. What you're proposing sounds... a little better. She'll be giving what's left of her life for someone else. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Since G5 has no one else. But what it's worth... You have my consent. Curie. Let's begin. Curie. Terminate Excellent. All Here we go. Essential operations. Affirmative. All right. Connection complete. There. <gasps> oh god, Curie, no. I I my chest. What is happening? I I feel I feel so strange. Listen to me. Can you hear me? What is your name? My designation is Contagions Vulnerability Robotic Infirmary Engineer. Oh, Curie, thank you, Doctor, for this opportunity. Excellent. So, with Emergent Behaviour finished, we have got Curie into a... I should probably go and check that she wants to follow me, actually. I've just left her there. Okay, she is following me. Lovely. So, with Curie apparently needing a period of adjustment, I think the best thing to do is get her back to normality. And how better to do that? than to throw it into the thick of the fighting. In fact, come to think about it, that's that's just not gonna that's not gonna work. We're gonna need to get her some appropriate gear and thinking about it, I left a bunch of stuff on her, you know, murder globe body, so I should probably go and grab that too. <laughs> okay, so take all of that and then hope she's caught up. Right. Kiri, come here. Right. Hey. And I was going through all the junk that apparently Kiri had on her, she had a power relay coil, so <laughs> So that makes that bit easier then. I'm quite pleased I didn't buy one. Sadly, we don't seem to have any appropriate armor or weapons, but I'm sure we'll come across something as we go. So let's make our way to the Insane Asylum. And the Brotherhood are at it again. They seem to be very busy. So I've decided to take a bit of a detour. So I'm gonna to head to the Insane Asylum via Ericstead, as I need to get some more water and some food. And, caravan or raider? Oh. What? I said caravan or raider. Which are you? What? I'm here on my own. Freelance, huh? All right, come on in, but no gunfire. Maybe I don't have to. Maybe this place has what I'm after. Let's see what you have. So you have a ooh, muzzled rapid machine gun. Mm, no, ooh, Wastelander's friend, 50% more limb damage. That is very expensive. Never mind. These look good. Plus one strength and endurance. Weight of 16, though. That's quite bad. Uh, makes me nice and quick with a Black Ops right shin guard. And you don't sell water. You know what? Never mind. As I came all the way to Bunker Hill, I may as well take this. Permanently gain 25 experience from persuading men. I mean, it may come up, but probably not with my charisma. And you know what? I was excited that you'd fit through doors with your new body, but unfortunately, you're, you're in the way. <gasps> oh my god. Nearly leapt to my death. Right, well that's quite enough of that. On to Ericstead. And actually from here it's pretty much a straight shot, so it should be quite easy. Oh, but not if there's bandits in the way. They haven't seen us yet. Oh, now she has. Oh, there's one over there as well. Okay, right. Take out this one nice and easily. And then if I swing around the outside, although the music seems to indicate that all the threat's gone. Carla's on the move. Oh, Carla's helping. Good job, Carla. Right, where's the... I 
This is going to be easy. And after a quick hop, skip and a jump, you find us back at Ericstead where I can resupply, but I've just realised something. I am the world's worst pet owner. Did, uh... Oh, he did. Oh, thank God for that. Don't worry, dog meat. Just saying hello. Oh, I am the world's worst pet owner. I'm so sorry. I just completely left him outside Fort Hagen. There we go. It's a way to try and make it up to him. I've just made him a nice little doghouse. Do you like it? Do you like the doghouse? Good boy. And then if I go into the workshop, it's been producing purified water. So I'll grab a bunch of those just to take on my way. And the only other issue is that I don't feel like I have enough food, but hopefully I can find something along the way. Right, now on to our objective. So if we just have a look at where we are now, we are at Taffington Boathouse. If I just go up and try and join up with the main road, that should lead us to roughly where we need to be. What, why, is, why, is it not on the, why is it not on the map? Okay, now I've set it as an active quest. It's showing on my map, so let's head along that way. So having decided to have a quick nap at Ericstead just to sort of consolidate our position so to speak let us hit the road so we are just going to pop north here round to the east and then meet up with the main road which will take us hopefully to the insane asylum and we will try and achieve our objectives oh but it's not going to be that straightforward is it no 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 why would it be there are bugs so so many bugs and they are everywhere they are all over there as well oh and they're attacking right fall back Kiri fall back ouch that's it, that's it. Pulling into the turrets, pulling into the turrets. Oh god. Okay, that seems to have thinned a few of them out. No, no. Settler, what are you doing? Stop it. No, oh god. How many more are there? Not too many, but it seems like Ericstead has gone to war with the mosquitoes. Well, seemingly that's, uh, that's cleared those out. Thanks for all your help, guys. Right, so we'll just pop up here. Do we want to explore this facility? Uh, oh. I think I see gunshots up ahead. What's that? Let's try and get up high and see what's going on. Hmm, super mutants and synths. No, I think we'll leave them to it. This looks relatively safe. Although, what are you? Don't want to get too distracted. Let's keep on our way. Seems quiet enough, and oh, zombies! Problem is they're quick, and when there's one, there's usually a whole bunch, so... Come on, land they hit. Oh god! We are injured again, so I am just going to pop over here. Just going to quickly pop a stim pack and drink some more water. It's a good job we picked up so much water from Ericsson. But take this opportunity to take as much as I can. Oh, hello. Two stim packs, but ah, sadly, no armor. So had another little nap just to keep me top up because I was getting tired and let's continue on our way. Truly it seems like everything out here is trying to murder me. I have to be super vigilant, it's keeping me on my toes. And thinking about it, I probably shouldn't be running through the wilderness as that's where all of the enemies are, but what have we here? This this looks like something. Uh oh. I do not want to go there. Those are laser turrets. Those would surely be a problem. Okay. Uh oh, bear. It's a bear. He hasn't seen me. He could ignore the bear or... I did nothing. I did nothing. Right, it's hammer time. Oh. Good job, Kiri. And that's really cool. This is the first time I've actually used my sledge since I've upgraded it. And it glows. A friendly reminder not to grab the business end of this hammer, clearly. And... Well, that looks intimidating in the dark. What's going on over here? Looks like a forge. Right. Well, we don't want to get too distracted. So, let's sneak around. Although, there's something here as well. Although this, at least, looks to be a little bit friendlier. Ooh. 
again, another settlement completely seemingly run by by zombies. Well, I'll leave you guys to it. You, uh, you seem to be having a great time. And whilst I had planned to actually go along down here and up the road, the place I need to be is there. I didn't take Aqua Boy for nothing, so I might as well cross this river, as I can't be irradiated by it anymore, and I can breathe underwater as well. Nice little shortcut. Right. Let's go and see what's going on in this insane asylum. Here we are. In fact, we didn't even come to the front door. We, we bypassed it altogether. But we find ourselves at the asylum, finally. Okay. This place is off limits. You'd best move along. Hello, Maria. I've been sent to talk to you. Edward Deegan sent me. I'm looking for a missing package. Oh. You're the new guy. So this package... Pretty sure we know where it is. The guys that shot Ben are holed up in the Parsons Creamery. Who are these guys? Assholes with guns. Though it's weird that they're still hanging around so close. Kinda like they're scouting this place or something. I don't like it. I'm glad you're gonna finally get rid of them. Well, we've been told where we need to go, and it is the Creamery, which is apparently just north of here. So I can't say I'm too thrilled by the prospect of assholes with guns. And you are an unfortunate courier. But what it does allow me to do is give you some armor. So I'll be doing just that. And if I get you to equip all of these, there we are. You're a touch more protected now. And this is presumably where we need to go. Sounds like they're inside, but it also sounds like they're arguing. Does mean it's going to be slightly risky to get in there. And with that, we have taken them down. That was. That was good. And we have the mysterious serum, which. Fancy, look at that. So we will take that as well as some of his bits and pieces and ah, ah apparently some more armour. If I just apply these it means that potentially we can give some better armour to Curie. And let's get out of here. We are being approached by more raiders. Two of them, right, okay. is down and I have taken a few nasty hits so it's only one thing for it oh god there are loads of them okay I do not want to be here at all I do not want to be here at all oh and bloody Kiri's got taken down as well and there's a mercenary what the hell is going on so it seems to have gotten really nasty around here, really quickly. Kiri has apparently made her way back to Erikstead, which is fine with me, but I now need to get back to Cabot House and do so quickly. This is very, very unsafe. I'm willing to take any further risks. I'm going back to Erikstead myself. I'm just going to get a quick rest, pick up Kiri again, and then go back to Cabot House. Remember to breathe. I keep thinking huh? if I forget to do this, no more curry. And suddenly, all this excitement we do, there is an element of something new. What if my arm is blown off? It is not so simple to repair this now. Are you afraid? I suppose it could be fear, but something else as well. It is a jumble. I... I will be fine. It is coming to me. Quickly, I hope. Just bear with me. I am sure my research will blossom with this magnificent new hardware. So the reason that conversation jumped over here is because I tried to have it three bloody times but just kept walking off. And glad to see Dogmeat is enjoying his new doghouse. And without any further ado, let's head back to Cabot House and give Jack Cabot his mysterious serum. 
And one thing I did have to deal with on the way over here that I don't want to deal with on the way back is all of these mines. As you can imagine, I wasn't too keen on walking across that the first time round. Oh, 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 run. Okay, that was badass. That was, that was really cool. Also, I'm really sorry I walked you into that explosion. Couple more zombies to deal with. And a level up to boot. And with our level up, we will be taking another rank in Action Boy, which is available at level 18. We now get 15% action point regeneration, which is really, really big. And I felt like the Brotherhood were over here doing something as well. Which is usually a fairly good indicator that I don't want to be there, as it means there's going to be conflict. So back the way we came along here towards the Bunker Hill site very quickly pop into Bunker Hill to sell all the bits we've picked up that we don't need anymore. And then nice and easy heading south towards Cabot House. And here we go. Back at Cabot House. Could not be simpler. Imogene is missing and I want her found. She's not missing, mother. Do you know where she so is? So did you find out what happened to the courier? Quite, Deacon. This is interesting. I want her found. What else is Edward for if not to keep the family safe? Mother, Edward has better things to do than sending someone out to find Imogene. Again. If your father were here, he'd send someone to find Imogene. I'm not going to have Edward drop everything just because Imogene decided to take a lover again. Jack, how dare you speak so disrespectfully about your sister? Okay, bit of family drama. Just some raiders that ambushed him. Hmm, I don't like raiders operating so close to Parsons. I hope this isn't the start of something serious. What about the serum he was carrying? Did you get any of it back? There was only this one vial left. Oh, good. I was afraid we wouldn't get any of it back. Here's your pay for the job. I'm throwing in a little bonus for bringing back the serum. That was good work. Now, as far as what's next... Oh, hell. I guess it's time you met Wilhelmina. Jack's not gonna be happy about it. Come on. And now I'm getting embroiled in their family nonsense as well. Okay. Jack, I'll take care of it. Mrs. Cabot, don't worry. I'll send someone to find Imogene. Thank you, Edward. I can always count on you. Why can't you be as devoted as dear Edward? You shouldn't indulge her, Edward. It just makes it more impossible to deal with next time. Just doing my job. Speaking of which, here's all we got back of the last delivery from Parsons. Raiders got the rest of it, I'm sorry to say. Ah, oh, good. Finally. This will help settle Mother down. Emma Jean is Jack's sister. You probably figured that out yourself. She's, uh, a little flighty. Impulsive. From time to time, she runs off. Usually with a new boyfriend. Then I send somebody to bring her home. No problem. I'll bring her back. The trouble usually isn't finding her. It's persuading her to come home. I don't know where she's gone, but I can give you a place to start. She's been spending a lot of time in Good Neighbor. That's a jazz club there, the third rail. Somebody there must know something. She's not known for keeping her mouth shut. There's a slight problem. If it's going to come down to convincing someone of anything, it's not really my forte, but... Uh... What if she doesn't want to come home? Obviously, as one of the family, you can't just knock her in the head and drag her home by her heels. Usually, by the time I send someone after her, she's gotten bored with the whole thing and is ready to come home. I'm sure you'll think of something. You're supposed to be resourceful, remember? Well, there we go. We seem to have picked up another little job to go and find this Imogene Cabot and try and convince her to come home. With any luck, the new boyfriend will be a little bit less shooty than the raiders we've had to deal with just a minute ago. Well, that gives me something to do next time out. If you have liked this video, stick a like on the video for me and subscribe as these videos go out every single Fallout Friday. If there is somewhere in particular you would like to see Eric go, then drop it in the comments down below and we'll go check it out. However, all of that is coming up next time. So in the meantime, take care of yourselves. ta -ra.